Our neighboring ruler, Amir Feda of the Faravid Emirate, has now become our rival after the events that transpired at the event we hosted, a hunt. Find out how Amir Feda brought shame upon the Gurid name and why he is our rival later in the episode. Welcome back to our journey in rebuilding the Gurid dynasty. We're here in episode 10 with Amir Yaqub. And the last episode, we just finished expanding east. And remembered, we raised up our full army and we still had like plus four gold. So that's a great sign to reinvest in the army. And that's one of our three goals for this episode to max out our army. Let's go ahead and do that. Build the one there. Build the other one there. We still got 100 gold. And my second goal for this episode is to hit this, uh, to fill out this crown and this regalia artifact. And I'm not sure if we're gonna hit this last uh, goal. Would be to, uh, or well, that would be the 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 goal to hit. And then our next goal would be to invite knights. Prestige and money we're gonna need. We have prestige. We gotta rebuild the 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 gold after we get this artifact. And what I want to do while we're in this uh, unrest phase and we're able to uh, conquer and expand and wage war is probably uh, conquer this county out here into this uh, kingdom just to f continue expanding our realm and our reach we have a current truce with this character here as we just conquered his land last we have this, this truce here for five years we could also go up north with this character here which is we're closest to forming this kingdom so this is always an option as well we can currently wage war against him no problem 900 troops and then um what's interesting as well because we have a couple duchy claims with our sisters who are matrilinearly married we, uh, we have a duchy claim here with this character but because it's a press claim and he's a supporter and we're just we, we might just leave it as is and wait till their children um it's guaranteed guaranteed that they will have a uh, gurid children who will be able to inherit the throne is because she might die in childbirth have a daughter and then uh, the gurid line will not rule this after what, what, what we've done so We'll wait till they'll have children. We'll probably just grant them a county, this county maybe even, and then their second son or third son or whoever can uh, will have the opportunity to press this claim with them. And the next duchy claim was over here, the Samanid Kingdom with this capital. But no, it's a duchy right here with our other sister and our brother-in-law here. And it would be a good opportunity for this one, this timing, because this king is currently losing a war. His troops are decimated. But it is almost over, so we may not be uh, wise to do that right now. And his ally is this guy here, this Turk here, or I believe he's, uh, okay, Sugdu, this character here. And we do, we're going to wait to deal with this character because he is strong. But we're going to wait to take him out at, um, all together once we hit this illustrious. And we can conquer this whole duchy in uh, one war, as opposed to going from uh, targeting him piece by piece. Now the next the main goal for this character is for Jakob's life. Um, well, let me go ahead and press play just a little bit that way because let our army rebuild. But our main goal for Jakob's life as he is only 23. But we've had uh, some unfortunate events with all our characters dying young. So we'll see what happens. Amir Yaak, uh, Ibrahim at 26 and our main character Sudi at 32. So uh, we'll see how it goes for him. And uh, but this capital, uh, this duchy of Nishpaur, Nishapur is the capital duchy of our uh, our main kingdom that we're in that we want to target Khorasan and it is also the capital duchy and kingdom of our culture so this is the move right here this duchy here and it has some very powerful buildings we already have one of them in that land and you can see it has a special building as it is and that's not even the capital. This is the capital. So we'll get the duchy building and a special building with what gives a good tax and development growth rate and has a lot of uh, um, holdings that we can build. So that's the that's our target here. Our child. Oh, dang. She's no longer pregnant. OK, unfortunate. So that would be our goal there. We could also wage war on this character here. He has a powerful ally. Oh, this guy right here, this duchy. We want to take out um, who's in control of this duchy here. This man here is in control of it. He is older though, 50. And he does have a powerful ally right, right next door. So 
we're gonna have to wait um we could take him as it is but just to preserve our prestige we're gonna wait till he, he passes and this guy is 60 as it is but he has oh yeah he's a negotiating a lot oh wait but his other ally here is at war with the caliphate um uh, with another uh, invasion war conquest sponsored conquest so that would be a good timing to take this guy out as well 1300 we could take him out as he has 19 we'll still have more than them altogether and we lost quite a bit on that one so let's go ahead and start expanding our realm actually because we could always conquer this guy no problem we're gonna go ahead and take out this guy and it also connect the lands for our liege so you know we're doing them right we're doing them justice like that and uh, one th another thing i noticed is because we're we're our steward we could claim our uh oops wrong one we can claim our uh, liege's throne with a scheme that's interesting our character is deceitful but he's also compassionate and just so our character amir Jacob, is the epitome of never let them know what your next move is so we could always keep that in the back pocket and see if we want to do that form this kingdom here and become powerful right away or build our land build a little tall first give ourselves a nice uh, base to build off of to go further on uh, conquests and kingdoms and duchies and all that for the Gurid dynasty especially with this legacy uh, of persia pack and the house unity I definitely want to be going down the harmonious house unity level because it's going to be uh, the best for our succession. The wars are a little more costly, but you'll deal, you won't deal with no um, succession crisis and no factions, less factions at least. So that's what I want to do there. And plus the the members of having uh, Gurid dukes and kings is going to further boost our renown to just further increase our gameplay, give us more power. So let's go ahead and wage war here, connect our liege's lands. And the other thing was he is a detractor and of a different sect of the faith. So this would be our best option here. And then let's go ahead and... Okay, they're still raising, but they're almost there. Almost finished. Raise the troops there. And we shouldn't need any more than that. And let's go send the troops. Remember, okay, that guy, that ally joined the war, that powerful ally, but he is busy with the Abbasid Caliphate. And his ally is here, that's right. So we'll raise the rest of our men. Raise the rest of them. And then we'll send them there. Who is this? Have him, our best commander. And let's go ahead and do that. Okay, we were able to catch him, excellent. Ooh, nice, we got a blundered... Re so let's go ahead and... Um, and this character who's your parents will go for you right here convert faith and uh, we'll afghan's fine we have a high uh, high cultural acceptance with them let's go ahead and see what this blundered claim is where oh, okay it's for that uh, okay okay and it's in the different kingdom as well so we could do that that would be interesting oh see that that war is already over there oh they lost that war Oh, no, they didn't. Okay. He just becomes part of his realm. Okay. I thought he becomes independent. That sponsored conquest. Oh, that's right. And um, because we gifted, uh, we landed our uh, brother-in-law, he does not like us. Rightfully so. He's an excellent diplomat and he wants to be on the council. But we currently have an excellent diplomat on the council. So we weren't, we're not able to do that for him at the moment. But our, our diplomat is a little older. So it shouldn't be uh, too long before he's on the council. He just has to be a little bit more patient. And I want to go ahead and let's commission this artifact. Start working on that other goal. And we'll get a regalia first before we get a crown. Hopefully we get a better crown if we hit a uh, illustrious. So let's see how many months we have there. We have five months. Who is this? Our half-sister. The Salmonid. See, Dilar, Kina, Dilar. We'll just go Dilar. Right there, our niece. You educate your daughter. And, okay, excellent. Let's go three speed. Three months there for there. Five years there. Okay. Yeah. So, I, I do really, really want to get this capital soon. That way we can move our capital over here. And um, have everything rocking in that powerful land and start building tall there. Although, this is the Gurid, the actual Gurid Emirate here. So, one could make the case that should be our kingdom. Then luckily he didn't go. He's gonna link up there. Strike a deal with the chief mason. 
45 percent chance we lose 50 percent chance peasant labor Ooh, that's not good stewardship challenge dang we have a really high stewardship too and it's really low odds for us it's a little higher now 56 percent chance we get prestige and that city gets okay boosted a construction time and decreased in the cost it's our best option hopefully it'll work let's see how it goes let's link these boys up we are gonna win it says excellent um, alhamdulillah god be praised i believe is what it means after a lengthy audience the chief mason will budge no further for a lower price than this it cannot be done oh damn i thought we got that one okay then we have an agreement uh i thought we got that one that's gonna put us at a significant uh yeah we'll just go with the it's still cool with it we still got a benefit out of it let's speed that up oh all right there's the war we capture got some targets some enemy oh some captured people let's go for cutting quarter stones i want to get to centralization and we can get some more gold there oh oh our tax guy died we'll just go this guy could scheme against us so we'll just go with this guy here he, uh, I, I would think it would give us a little bit of a opinion gain force demands nine months it's a cool minute and then let's go ahead okay this is dutchy this is an excellent piece of land as well let's go ahead and get this one to our uh, this guy oh this that's right okay oh where's the this guy here we go We'll grant it to them. Grant title. Here you go. Excellent. See if we can get him to convert. Dang. Highly unlikely. Okay. We'll, we'll still try though. We'll see what happens. Oh, that guy died. Alright. So now we could pounce. Now we can target him. Let's let our army rebuild just a little bit. Did lose some troops there. For the Okay. He wants a hook on us. We don't want to give him a hook as he is our now he is our courtier so we'll do that oh i never switched it to him wait a minute oh yeah i did okay 76 percent chance there we'll see your culture has joined the high medieval area okay era and i really do want to get to our tajik culture lands i don't want to switch to afghan we already switched the religion from the tajik making this a tajik run uh, because um, remember uh, Amir Ibrahim was ambitious and he had an opportunity to break free he wanted his independence so he had to convert faith to join that rebellion just for that rebellion to uh, fizzle out and become invalid so uh, it is what it is we are now the, a part of this uh, Ashariism faith or Ashari this guys okay let's go ahead and send our army there he has a very powerful army but we should get a bonus. We might. We, I don't even think we're going to get there in time. I don't think we're going to get there in time. It says we're going to win. Maybe it's because defending in mountains. Excellent. Hunter Renown. Inspiration. Okay. Yeah. Family model to our artifact. All right. Let's see. How long do we have to get there? 15 days. Yeah. We're not going to make it in time. Okay. So just because he's done that, we're going to have to go to war against him. Actually, we could just chase him. We'll chase him yeah we're gonna chase him let's go boys excellent he is leading it we are winning we killed one of his knights excellent the castle builder uh, i did under i did misunderstand it from the last event or last episode we got this uh the artifact lifestyle trait after it was finished constructing remember we got a free castle or the option of a free castle city or, ta or temple and we chose castle so the castle builder the towers gleaming in the morning sun the imposing walls keeping any attacker at bay Mayhana is truly a magnificent piece of construction and one to go down in history as the budding start of a new architectural talent namely myself this will do we get the castle builder nickname we get the trait the architect which is going to be excellent for us helping to help us build tall we get a nice little boost in prestige and maybe even uh, additional domain uh, holding and we get more renown tight so now we're like 100 renown away i think we're only like 100 renown away from uh from getting a new uh di dynasty legacy perk oh he raised up his army too is he at war 
No, he's not at war. So he raised up his army to fight them off. We killed a good amount of them. Nice, we killed a thousand of them. Damn. Our heavy infantry putting in work. As well as our knights. So once... Yeah, we could invite some more knights now. Just gotta get these guys disbanded. Come on. There we go. Learning on the job. It would appear that my stepfather has been performing exceptionally well lately. And so an opportunity has presented itself allowing me to greatly guide and influence his work for the foreseeable future. Perhaps this is an opportunity for him to further enhance his skills. Keep a ledger and organize his work. Nice. Uh, we don't want him increasing his intrigue. We get gold, but we're just... Oh, that one's nice. Prestige gain. We're going to go with the, this one here. Hopefully, uh, we should have picked the younger, uh, what do you call it, tax collector then. Oh, okay, so we didn't get enough. That's all right. This is the one here. That was the extra castle. That's right. So we'll go ahead and grant this one to somebody a little older. That way we can get it back in time. This guy here. And now we're back in business, ready to roll. Our army still got to get some new knights. Excellent. The regalia is already in. We got a little small boost in the prestige. We'll take it. It'll add up. Point is better than zero. So we'll take that. If you can personally oversee her education, we must decline. Sorry, sir. Can I do that for you right now? We are busy. Not a day goes by without my steward and stepfather butting heads. Right. Let's see if we can get them to settle. They'll still get closer to uh, passionate and just. We'll just go with this one. He converts. This is our city. No, he didn't convert it. Oh, he's converting it right now. He's working on it. I see. Okay. Mine must be the father. There's no doubt we're lovers. Someone wants to kill our bodyguard. Hmm. Someone may be plotting a murder scheme against us. This guy. Did we go to... Oh. On a... Oh, that's okay. He has... I'm tripping. I forgot we waged war for him already. I was like, how did he get an alliance with the king? That's his brother. Oh, what? His brother is his heir. Oh, damn. He's definitely motivated to have his own children. Though, rather than have it go here. I would imagine, at least. Okay, oh, we lost somebody on the council. Our brother-in-law definitely needs to be there. But we need excellent people on our court someone more vigilant and we'll go with this guy here 44 24 two years okay let's see four years 12 let's go 12 months we'll go right there and then we can go ahead and go to war i see our army is already almost fully built oh we didn't raise this one up to the max maybe on the next war let's get some more gold coming in oh he's at war who is he at war with the tyranny oh that person died they choked on their food. Oh, no. Eat y'all food slow. Chew your food, man. So we could go to war here. We could at least get this county here. Work towards this kingdom. We could do that. 2,000 troops. We now outnumber them. But these sieges are long. Let's go ahead and go... Yeah, let's go for a blitz. Let's go ahead and target... Actually, if you want quick wars. So let's go ahead and add this one to our... Our mix real quick. This one is only a... Uh, that uh, We'll put them down here, actually. We'll march south. Our friend and wife is pregnant. Oops. That should be enough there. That's enough there. And we'll send them. Actually, we'll split them. That way, in case they want to send one army up north. And we'll send them there. Let's speed that up. Oh! That was a lot closer than I would have liked. Frozen delights. Before anyone else, my keen eye and sweet tooth wife has noticed the conspic conspicuous deficiency at the dinner tables. There is no falude, she exclaims, referring to that cold dessert with noodles, syrup, and rose water that is every Persian's delight. I sent for the purveyor, she continues, and was told that the Yakchal ice houses have collapsed in an earthquake we must do something at once lest the whole court will suffer and become so hard one could mistake us for the eastern mystics do not need this kind of excess you are right nope and uh dang which one is this 
that's the one up north oh actually no i do not need this kind of excess nor do you we lose this romance that's okay we get a health boost we'll go with it we'll just go with this bottom one and let's see how this war is gonna do and hopefully we win okay and that was too close dang she's no longer pregnant we got a son this guy will be abdallah abdallah uh tax do is both excellent Ooh, wait a minute oh he gets a increase oh nice oh all these children need a just become just to confirm that's him that is not him who's here we go this guy and then we need we have a lot more people in our court let me just do that real quick Ooh, she has no guardian da -da -da, you will be fine and um this child oh she oh hold on this one go with our what is she she's a steward go with this lady here our sister-in-law and this guy here dang both of the parents got murdered it's cold-blooded go with her sister-in-law matrilineal okay that's fine yes convert the faith and what culture are you afghan that's fine and you need a guardian and we'll just go you there and oh we need more troops here damn 16 months 750 okay yeah so we'll send the rest of our troops there down south uh ishmael learns the arabic language okay sweet no we're not gonna raise your kids alliance expired interesting where is this at oh okay that's right okay yeah we married his sister i believe sister yep there it is another close battle let's see if he's willing to negotiate another alliance with us oops this guy and then um here allow me to help yep that's the excellent option right there and where is he i must let her go oh dang too much of a good thing never would i have thought that a man could have too much love yet it seems life has proved me wrong some days i feel as if my life my spare time is nothing but going on hunts with the larma dalaram and fantasizing about the future with her for how long can i go on like this these women will be the end of me i must let her go we stop being lovers or oh it might break me but what is life without love we'll keep both of them actually let's see deceitful compassionate and just yeah because he's compassionate i feel like he wants both very well he can join my court gains better company house unity he's of our house yep definitely he can come for sure is no longer at the throat okay, excellent everything's what's going on here new perk construction time and building okay i need to invite the knights now we have plenty of gold and our knights are getting a little older spend that prestige and let's continue there destroyed them with our numbers okay our first knight has arrived let's see oh this guy is excellent he's a he's sadistic he's a little evil you know but damn but we should have him for the long haul damn hold on hold on prestige if i get this uh legacy vibrant court now nah, we, we need a hundred more that's gonna be forever we'll go ahead and bring him on he's not of our faith he will accept 100 percent and this siege is almost finished let's go ahead and marry him off to this lady here let's we'll get some more people in our court there we go and four five okay three months he agrees check these battles we lost more troops and dang we lost more troops all right this one's almost over our lover has given birth to a daughter uma all right that's that one yep everything's there enforce demands disband and okay so this one came with the temple and this temple got a nice building it's a nice little money maker right there let's see okay y'all don't have children no i thought we gifted them land Okay, I guess we did not. We may have to... Oh, we might have some other dynasty members. I want them to have children first. Our cousin, he's the only oldest one. What about this guy? 
the brother. He is his chancellor. Okay. So we won't do him like that. Oh, he just came to our court, huh? That's right. He just got married. He's about to get married. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. We'll give him that. Boost up our house unity a little bit. Sweet. Okay, that's there. We got to let our troops rebuild again. Let's get uh, max that out. One more. And then we got to go on a hunt. Got to lose some of that stress. He's a good fighter. You can... 50 gold. We'll see what the next the next night is. Before we go ahead and do that. So we got this one. Does he have a leash? Alright. She won that battle. She now has an ally. She got more troops. Oh, with the mercenary. How did she get an uh, alliance there through marriage? Interesting. He's older though. He might pass. Okay. Brother-in-law was swayed again. He's still going strong there. Ooh, gotta convert a new one. Let's convert that county there. And okay. see what we got going on. I'm gonna we'll lose land. Oh, that's right. I forgot to ransom our prisoners. Ransom him. Ransom him. Marshall impresses vassal. Nice. Let's go ahead and go on a hunt. We gotta lose some stress. And or we could go on a feast as well. How do our vassals like us or not like us? Plus 12. Not too bad. Could be better. We could make our honorary guest our brother-in-law. Let's see uh right here. Hunt has gone up. Oh, here's a hunt right here. Oh, we're not gonna make it in time. March no, we're a month late. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and go on our yeah, let's go on our own hunt. And let's try let's go with this one right here. See how and then some of us a little close by. We'll go down here. And that's the one. Recreation, befriend, murder, slay, beast. Let's go uh, befriend, actually. No, we'll go recreation. We need recreation. Let's do that. I can't wait. Let's see how close we are. Okay, we're getting a little closer. See how this uh, hunt goes for our uh, goal to get more prestige. This guy's an excellent fighter. Soon, only 29%. Dang. Who's our best guy? He's uh, best or he's best. I think... Marshall and prowess, I would imagine. We'll go with this guy here. All right. Yeah, big time. 71% chance success now. Okay. And then what, how long do we need to wait? 921. Okay, one more year. Not bad at all. He assembles the party as the sun rises over the camp. And a stout buck is definitely in the area. And the conditions could hardly be better for hunting it. This ought to be good fun. Let's get out there. I will hunt something more. I would rather flush out a fox. Let's get the buck. Get back on your horses. That's fine right there. Increase the success chance. And our wife. We follow our quarry into the dry land slowly but surely. It suddenly spooks bounding away in another direction. And as I move to see what scared it. I can scarcely believe my eyes. A mirror and oh. This is our wife. Bro. On the ground in a passionate embrace. Back away, I saw nothing. Dang. She did us like that. You expose the secret. Get up. I feel the beast is nearby. This is disgrace. Cease this at once. I tire of this fate. I can consider divorcing her. And he becomes our rival. Where is he at? Oh, we already got a rival. This guy up here. We proceed by stealth. And we'll get prestige. Success chance decreases. We'll go by stealth. Is he independent? No, he's in our... We share the same liege. Bow in hand, quiet steps. Eyes on tall grass as I wait. The antelope, a deep breath. And is that a mere... F Ooh. My lewd rival crouches in the tall grass ahead of me. Fully concentrated on the approaching buck. I glance around surreptitiously. This might be the best opportunity I get. Such a shame I did not see him. Oh, he's accidentally wounded. 6% chance he gets lucky. 27% chance he dies. So because it's so low, we're just going to go ahead and lose the stress that we want. And because we're compassionate, it'll give us that. And strike true. We're not going to let him strike true. Come on. Pell him under arrows. Success. So a successful hunt. We boost that. I'll keep the memento. Stress game. Prestige. Renown. Yep. Finish hunt. Ooh. 
Dang, we got 375 uh, prestige off that. And we're going to go ahead and pin this guy. He's our rival now. See if we can go to war against him. We cannot go to war against him. Nice. We're almost illustrious. We can take this whole duchy. All right. Let's switch out one of these. Learning lifestyle. Yeah, we'll go ahead and switch that one. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. And then we could find a new wife after this lady here. Divorce. She loses 25 opinion and they will all lose 25 opinion. Yeah, I mean, I think that's what we got to do. She, nah, come on. Can't believe that. We'll go ahead and find her a new spouse just to bring somebody new. Let's go ahead and bring in a knight. This guy here is excellent. We're going to go ahead and bring him in. We got a new knight. And now we can get a new spouse. Potential new alliance. This guy is pretty powerful. 1,000. 1300 troops not too far let's keep looking though this guy here is at the tire right here this guy's a lot closer pretty much our border pretty powerful who would it be with his daughter so we could also get it as well is he uh interesting i'm down to go with this one this one as well probably this lady but let's quickly see if we can get anybody with some traits a genius or anything this lady here has this I would even make her our primary. Look at her traits. Actually, she has this one trait. That's fine. We'll go ahead and do that and get another alliance. We'll do that right there. Excellent. And we lost this one. Oh, oh I see. Dang, so we lost this alliance. Because we were married to her sister. His sister. Follow that child. We find the child and uncover the secrets. You fall and hurt yourself in the dark tunnels. Dang. So this guy was a very powerful ally. But, where is she? It's not even... I don't remember how she's related. He's continued to be swayed. Excellent. We're, we have 232 gold. And we keep expanding. We got this one here. Excellent. We could go here as well. We could probably even go to war against him now again. Yep. We could go to war against him as well again. Get this duchy. And form that kingdom. Yeah, okay, we're making excellent progress. We continue to expand our realm. We're almost uh, illustrious. And uh, we got a couple more children. We are now the castle builder. And everything is going well for Amir Jakob. Dang, some years flew by. Two years flew by. Okay, okay. Two years. We're putting our uh, sister-in-law's uh, husband, our brother-in-law's on the on as counts. Giving them land in hopes that they get uh, children with a Gurid. So to further boost our renown. And we're making our way towards that ultimate goal of our kingdom of Khorasan. The Tajik culture. To get back to that motherland right there. And that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.